Hey guys, it's Two Perfect Games or Adam, and what wonder weapon do you want in DLC 3? That's the question for today's video. What kind of wonder weapon do you want to see appear in DLC 3? Now, before we can actually answer that question, we have to further discuss wonder weapons in general. So the first thing that I want to discuss is how do you actually want to get the wonder weapon in DLC 3? Because there are actually a couple of ways we receive wonder weapons in zombies. The first way is just out of the box. Look at the giant. The Wonder Wolf is the wonder weapon on that map and the way you get it is just out of the box. That used to be how you got wonder weapons in zombies like in World of War and in Black Ops 1. And then Black Ops 2 came along, things got a little more complex, we started crafting wonder weapons and there are a whole bunch of upgrade steps. So it gets more and more complex as time goes on. And uh, now we kind of have a mixture of the two. We have building and we have have upgrading steps as well. Zetsubu no Shima Shadows of Evil was more just building. You have to get parts around the map and put it together and that would give you the wonder weapon and of course with Zetsubu no Shima you had upgrade steps if you wanted to and then Dries and Draka was pretty much just pure upgrade steps. So as you can see we have a lot of different ways to get wonder weapons and the first thing I want to really ask you guys or the first thing you have to consider before before answering the question I asked you guys at the beginning of the video is how do you want to receive this wonder weapon on this new DLC map that we're going to be getting very soon. So far in Black Ops 3 Zombies, I don't think there is anything wrong with the wonder weapons we have gotten so far. They are all unique and do their own thing. So, so far, so good. But one thing that I can tell that the community really likes, and this is going back to Origins, is having multiple wonder weapons on a map. It just works incredibly well because you have so much options and you don't have to do the same thing every single time, every game. You know, look at uh, Shadows of Evil and Zetsubu no Shima, for example, right? You're using the same wonder weapon on the map every single time. Now, there necessarily isn't anything wrong with that, but the thing is, when you look at a map like Origins and Horizon Draka, you can just choose to have a different wonder weapon every single game, and you're not using the same thing, which is nice and refreshing. Now, the majority of the time on, you know, Origins and Dryzen Draka, I'm using the, the Ice Staff or the Lightning Bow like 90% of the time, but sometimes when I'm bored of using that weapon, I can use a different staff or a different bow, and it gives me a bit of variety, and I really like that, and I know the community likes that as well. So that being said, the Wonder Weapon that I want in DLC 3 is something similar to Dryzen Draka in Origins. I just think this Wonder Weapon system works the best. Everyone in your game gets their own unique wonder weapon and the upgrade process for these wonder weapons at first are pretty difficult. Like when the map first came out like Origins and Dryzen Draka, these upgrade processes weren't easy. It isn't until months after when you really get the hang of it, you can upgrade these wonder weapons really quickly. So it's not like they're too easy to upgrade. At first they're really hard, but as time goes on, you get the hang of it, it's pretty easy, and as you guys could probably tell from my bow upgrade speed runs, you can do them relatively quickly now. So I love to see this Wonder Weapon system return. It just works so well in zombies, and everyone just really seems to enjoy it. So say they brought back this Wonder Weapon system in DLC 3, what kind of weapons could we get? Because think about it for a second, we've already had the staffs on Origins, we've had the bows, obviously, and also we've had swords on uh, Shadows of Evil, which I don't know if the swords were like super elemental, um, but we did have the swords, so they can't really do anything else with that. Um, one thing I honestly would not mind, and I don't know how many of you are going to agree with me with this, but I wouldn't mind seeing the staffs come back because the staffs were so awesome. Even if they gave us four brand new staffs or even if they brought back just the four original staffs that we had in Origins just with different upgrade processes, I wouldn't mind seeing that. But of course, we all want new things, so 
One idea that I had is maybe we can have like four elemental weapons. And what I mean by that is having a shotgun, a sniper, a SMG, or an assault rifle. And depending on your playstyle, you can pick whatever one of these weapons you want. And of course, each weapon is going to shoot regular bullets. But of course, um, upgraded bullets and it has its own unique thing. And then just like the staffs, how you could revive people with it, you would have like a couple of shots to revive people. With these weapons, you would have a couple of shots to do just this, you know, crazy elemental damage with that one specific weapon. And I think that could be pretty cool, but obviously they probably won't do anything like that. It's just an idea that I had, but just that system, I really wanted to come back. I think the community would love it. And uh, like I said before, it just makes playing zombies or that one specific map a lot more enjoyable. So I'm gonna ask the question one more time. What kind of wonder weapon do you guys want to see in DLC 3? Do you guys want to see something simple like getting the wonder weapon out of the box? Do you want to craft it? Or do you want what I want? Do you guys want multiple wonder weapons on the map? Let me know in the comment section below. Let's have a huge discussion in the comments. Give me a good amount of detail on what you guys want to see. And if you have any wonder weapon ideas, leave it in the comment section below. Uh, also leave the video a thumbs up. I'll try to hit 1000 likes on this video and make sure to subscribe for more Black Ops 3 Zombies content. And like always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.